So we're out here at the Mossberg site in uh, Montana. This site uh, in 1995 was reclaimed by the Helena National Forest Service in cooperation with the DEQ of Montana and a whole lot of your tax dollars. Um, what you've had left is what we've seen a lot of here is that mine reclamation doesn't just hurt the mine, it hurts everything around it. What you can see here used to be a road, used to be a hiking trail. Um, in 1995 when they came through and did the reclamation here, instead of just stopping and blocking the mine, they actually went through and tore up rocks all the way up the road, threw trees over the road, really made an ugly mess. You can see we're here, this is almost 19 years later, and it's still an ugly, disgusting mess. Um, what this hurts is not only people's access to get out to the minerals, like we're doing out here, but it also hurts anyone else's ability to recreate. Um, families don't come out here, families aren't gonna come out and see the history because there is no trail anymore. The roads are wiped off the maps, and basically it's the Forest Service attempt to take a whole bunch of this land back and make it completely unusable to anybody from families to miners to foresters to hunters. So one more way that mine reclamation hurts America. Well, we're here at a little unnamed mine site that is uh, just off the Prosper main mine. Um, this was, it's really sad, this was obviously a, a big operation for probably a small little group of guys. Um, but the reclamation that they've done here has destroyed all the history and anything that's up here. Uh, part of this was done in the name of water, but strangely enough, there is no water that's running down here. Um, if you take a look behind me, you can see there used to be a wall built up here. When they did the reclamation, they just tore all the rock down and destroyed this wall completely. Um, what you're left with is, you know, again, something that you can't hike through, something that you can't visit at all. Uh, you can see up top there's some timbers from the buildings and the cabins that used to be here. A lot of them have been burned, which leads me to think that was probably done in the reclamation because there's no other trees you can see that are burned here. Even all the dead ones have no marks of burn on them. This is the road we followed in. It's been purposely blocked with trees, trees, trees. And uh, then if you look down, you can kind of see where we're headed to. We're going to be heading down this, what used to be the road. Vosburgh's over there, and uh, you can see where they've destroyed the entire road along the side of the mountain. The cut's still there, it's never going to go away, but uh, all they've managed to do is just make it inaccessible for uh, anyone that wants to use their public lands or that wants to hike around and see some history. So, one more notch in the uh, reason of why we should not be destroying these mines. And while well, I'm there, since I almost forgot, they say there's no more minerals on these lands. We have silver right here, quite a bit of silver. And uh, as my partner here found, some nice pyrites that have bits of gold in them too. Just sitting right out on top. So uh, yeah, there's a lot to be found out here and a lot that could really bring a lot back to America.